Hi there, fellow campers, and welcome to Camping 101 with Gallivanting SA. Today we're talking tablecloths. Alan shook his head when I said I wanted to talk tablecloths. But for those new to camping, it might be something that they don't know about. Do they even need one? What options are there? So let's chat about that today. Let's start with the question, do you even need a tablecloth? Well, a tablecloth will help with spills and messes and will protect your table. Depending on the type of table you have, especially if it's wood or one of those rougher plastic finishes, dirt will accumulate in all those little nooks and crannies and it'll often lead to a dark, yucky color and it may harbor some unhealthy bacteria. Let me say I'm absolutely not germ phobic. I've made my fair share of elephant dung paper. But there is clean dirt and dirty dirt. Clean dirt is not a problem and it can often be quite cute. But dirty dirt, such as fecal matter from monkeys and baboons, is where my tolerance ends. Let's say you come across a lovely picnic area with a bench and a table for your lunch, but it's covered with lots of white specks of bird poop and all around there are monkey footprints. I will sometimes give the table a light spray with the surface cleaner or a wipe down with an antibacterial wipe. We are not sponsored by Mr. Sheen and I've never met him, but these are the products that I'm currently using. Okay, let's talk about the actual tablecloths. Well, a tablecloth does stand as a barrier between your food and anything that may be on the table. And hey, they do look pretty. Here's a selection of material tablecloths that I have made over the years. I pick a material that's got some sort of a pattern or print, and it just helps to hide any stains or marks that you will undoubtedly pick up at some stage. The other benefit of making your own is that you size them to the table that you usually camp with. Material tablecloths are good at soaking up small spills and they can easily be washed. Now, an alternative is a plastic tablecloth. I got this one from Westpac for 40 Rand. And for me, I really don't like these. They're too light, they're too flimsy, and they're actually likely to be used once and then thrown away. And, and not being a fan of single use plastics, this is really not one that I would suggest, but it does fold up very tiny and very light and may be handy just to throw into your picnic basket. Now you can get a better quality of plastic with a lining on the back. This one is from Pep Stores. It was also 40 Rand. The backing is more like an iron-on stiffening material, but this is one that you can clean and reuse many times. It also folds down fairly easily into a small size. I went to my local material shop and picked up some even heavier duty plastic. It's a material that's lined with a more robust fleece backing. This doesn't fold up into a particularly small package, but it is easy to clean and will outlast the others. Another idea is to use a large piece of clear plastic over your cloth tablecloths. This is going to protect your cloth tablecloth. My problem with this, and I mean, I've bought it and I've tried it, is it's big, it's unwieldy, it's difficult to fold, it's very sticky, it sticks together. It, I'm sorry, it doesn't work for me, and I don't like it, and I don't use it. If we're out and about, and I want to set up a little table, but I don't have a table, I'm very happy to use a dishcloth over a rock as a standard. I always have one or two dishcloths in my picnic basket, which I can just use as a substitute for a tablecloth. So at the moment in our camper van, the thing that's working for me is to use my heavier plastic tablecloth on the working table. This is where food is prepped and cooked. And then I have a cloth tablecloth on the little table where we sit and eat. This is what's working for me at the present time, but should our circumstances change, I will change what I'm using. Well, that's it for this one. Thanks so much for joining us. Please leave me a note in the comments below. What works for you? What do you use? What, do you, what solutions do you have that I haven't thought of? Remember, the only thing that's right is the thing that's right for you. Stay safe, stay well, and I hope to catch you in a campsite sometime.